Septolab launches its first game not based in the famous Katarov franchise. True to its style, the Russian studio brings us another puzzle game with nice, charming and pleasant aesthetics based on problem solving using logic. In padding monsters, the challenge will be to unite the jelly characters which are scattered around the screen to form a single big monster. Just sliding our finger across the screen, we can take the jelly pieces where we want, but due to its slippery nature, we need to use barriers to avoid them falling to the kitchen floor. It's that simple. As usual in these games, there are thousands of ways to solve the problem, but in order to get the high score, we must create a new master and tiles marked with a star, adding some difficulty. There are several characters with different powers we have to use to get our own way. For example, some that leave a slime that serves as a barrier, others move in a block or there will be some others who are asleep and can be moved. Despite its 75 levels, the low difficulty makes the game will be over too soon. A message at the end informs us that there will be more levels of level in the future, but we will have to wait. Paddy Monsters is entertaining and pleasant to the eye, but not very original. Perhaps its bigger problem is that it's too easy, but that may change with the updates that are pending. For the moment we will have to resign ourselves with its limited possibilities, but it's fun at least. Yeah, hey, how's it going? Uh, easy.